Mr. Morgan, yes. how you doing? I'm Tom. Oh, I'm working with Dr. Really Jones. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? What's going on? I have a terrible pain in my chest. Oh, yeah? <clears throat> Can you tell me a little bit more about it? Uh, I just started last night. I came in and mm -hmm. was laying around getting ready to think, think about going to get something to eat, and it just started. And it's been there all night. You say it started last night? Yeah. Okay. Uh, on a scale of 1 to 10, what would you rate it at? Oh, about a... A six or a seven. Okay, and and it was in your chest. Yeah, right, kind of, right in the center. Okay, kind of like where your heart is. I hope it's not my heart. Really? Yeah. Why? I, mean, I had a heart attack before. I'm just you know I don't want to okay. have another one. Okay, you had a heart attack before. Yeah. When was that? Oh, about five years ago. Oh, five years ago. Okay, all right. But I'm a little worried about that, but we'll get back to that. Um, so have you been lifting any weights recently or doing more exercise than normal? No, no. Okay. Um, eating anything out of the ordinary? No. Right. Uh, have you had any diarrhea or nausea no. and vomiting? No, no. Okay. So have you ever had this kind of pain before? Not like this, man. Really? Anything make it better? Actually, just leaning forward like this almost kind of make it dissipate a little bit. It's, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's tolerable. Okay. Um, so you had a heart attack before. Uh, have you had any problems since then? How often do you go to dialysis? Um, I'm supposed to go three times a week. Great. Okay. And, um, and you have quite a list of medications. Uh, do you take your medications correctly? Uh, like clockwork. Okay. And no bad side effects, right? No. Any alcohol use? A couple beers here and there. Mm -hmm. Great. Sounds like you haven't been sick. You're you're doing pretty well, yeah. except for this right. recent episode here. Okay. Um, I'll be honest. I, I'm a little worried about this. I I'm worried that it might be a heart attack, given your history. Oh, um, man. Yeah. I, you know, we're gonna do a lot of a lot of tests and stuff, and and we'll we'll get to the bottom of it. I mean, it could be, it could also be, electrolytes related to your kidney disease. Um, it could be. Uh, something in your chest wall, like it could be, you know, bones or related to muscles. Um, it also could be something in your GI tract. Uh, it could be a lot of things, but I'm I'm worried about the heart attack. If that's it, then I'm gonna have you jump up on the table. I mean, no, sorry, don't jump up on the table. Uh, we'll get you up on the table real slowly, and I'm gonna do a physical exam. Okay. Mr. Morgan? Yes. Uh, we're going to do a quick physical now again, okay? Okay. Um, so, first off, I'm going to have you follow my finger with your eyes. Okay. Good. Okay. Um, and I just want to listen to your lungs. Have you take some deep breaths? Oh, it hurt when I take deep breaths, but... I'll do your best. Um, can I have you sit up a little straighter? Oh. Yeah. Just kind of listen to your heart here. Okay. Can I have you lay back? I'm going to look at your belly. Okay. This hurt at all? No. Okay. It, now, you you don't really have any tenderness in your ribs here, right? No. You loosen up a little. Oh. Sorry. Oh. oh. Okay. I don't feel any masses. That's good. All right. Well, uh, yeah, I can have you sit up now. Okay. Appreciate it. Check your reflexes real quick. You can just relax your leg. Right. Relax your leg. Okay, well again, I, I am real concerned about uh, the, the heart, okay? Um, we're gonna have to do quite a few tests here. Uh, we, we're gonna probably get, um, get some blood work done. We gotta look at the enzymes in your heart. 
Um, we're probably going to want to, I guess we'll put an IV in or mm. two. Uh, Same old stuff, huh? Yeah, if you have, I, I know, you've probably been through this before. Um, if the pain's an issue, we could give you morphine um, and uh, we'll get you some oxygen. We're probably going to want to do an echo, um, which look to look at your heart and an ECG. You haven't had an EKG yet, right? No, not since I've been here. Okay. We'll probably want to do that. Hello, Mr. Morgan. Hello. Hi, how are you doing today? Not too good. Okay. Um, well, my name is Pam. I'm the medical student down here in the ED today. Okay. I'm just going to talk to you for a little bit and see what's going on. Okay. And um, then I'm going to talk to the doctor and we're going to come back in and try to help you together. I appreciate it. Okay. Um, so I saw here that you're coming in for chest pain. Yeah. Okay. Well, before we get to that, is there anything else that's concerning you that you want to talk about? No, that's it right now. Okay. So why don't you tell me a little bit about it? I got this, this terrible pain in my chest. It just started all of a sudden. Okay, so it start, when did it start? Oh, late last night. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I came in and you know, laid around watching TV and thought about going to get something to eat. And But after that thought, it just started happening. It's been painful ever since. Okay. All right, so you said last night it started, yeah. and that brings us up to now. Okay, tell me a little bit about what you were doing when it started. Just laying, laying across the bed watching TV. It just came on. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, so describe the pain for me if you could. It's a sharp, deep pain just right in the center of my chest. Mm -hmm. It just won't go away. Okay, and so it won't go away. Has it been continuous since last night? Yeah, yeah. Okay. If it, has it gotten worse? Well, no, it's right about the same. Okay. All right, so you were lying in bed and you felt the pain deep in your chest. Was anything else going on at that time? No, no. Okay. So, um, did you notice pain anywhere else? Any other symptoms going on? No, oh, yeah, well, it just, it just went to the top of my shoulder and just kind of just stopped right there. Okay, and has that been continuous? Yeah, since? Okay. Yeah. Um, has, uh, has anything made it better? Actually, leaning forward like this kind of makes it calm down a lot. Okay, so leaning forward seems to help. Yeah. Are you comfortable right now? Oh, yeah, this is good. This is good. Okay. What's made it worse? Oh, boy. The lying down. Mm-hmm. Um, deep breaths. Okay. Deep breaths. Or coughing or sneezing. Really. Can you tell me a little bit about your day that day? Uh, well, during the day, I mean, I, I 
drive school bus part time, so I did that. Mm -hmm. And I kind of just um, went to my club and tried to open up a bar. Okay. So I went there and put a couple hours in, mm -hmm. and then I bounced at night, you know, okay. part time. So they needed me, so I went over there, okay. bounced for a couple hours, and came in. Okay. So you're a busy guy. What have you tried to help it? Actually, believe it or not, I tried some Maalox. I thought it was maybe it might be gas or something, mm -hmm. but that didn't do any good. It didn't do any good. No. When you use Maalox in the past, does it usually help you? Well, yeah. If I have gas or something like that, but like I said, um, everybody keeps a bottle of Maalox around. To summarize, it seems like you've had this chest pain. It started since last night. Um, it's been continuous um, up until now. Right. Um, it's pretty much right in the middle of your chest, and mm -hmm. uh, you said it goes up to your shoulder. And leaning forward seems to help like you're doing right now. Oh, yeah. Laying down makes it worse. Right. And it also says here that you... Um, have um you had a heart attack yeah five years ago that was entirely different it was like i had an elephant sitting on my chest okay i mean i was throwing up mm -hmm. my, you know pain up and down my arm and no matter what i did i couldn't find no relief okay and the pain is that that pain oh, isn't like this no, not like this you're on dialysis right okay um how often are you supposed to go Supposed to go three times a week. Okay, and how often have you been going? Well, um, I missed. I did miss a couple in the last two weeks. So, Mr. Morgan, we're just going to do a quick physical, and then um, we're going to talk about what we think might be going on. Okay. Um, so, I'm just going to take a quick listen to your heart right now. Okay. Do you mind if I undo your gown from the back? I'll go right ahead. Oh, thank you. Okay. Now, I know you said that you get some pain with taking a deep breath, but do you think you take a couple for me? I'm just going to try to listen to your lungs. Okay. Thank you. I'm just gonna feel your belly, okay? okay? Just tell me if there's any pain. Okay. Have you noticed any new swelling in your feet or anything like that? No. Okay. So, Mr. Morgan? Mm -hmm. All right, so what do you think is going on? I don't know. I just hope I'm not having another heart attack. I know. It seems like you've been pretty worried about that. Yeah. Okay. Well, based on what you've told me, I don't think that this is a heart attack. Oh, good. Okay? Um, what we're going to do is we're going to run a few labs and we're, um, basically we're going to test for a few enzymes in your blood. Um, that helps us tell if, how your heart's working, okay. basically. And it can help us tell if you're having a heart attack, but I'm pretty sure you're not. Oh, good, um, good. We're also going to do an EKG, and I think you've had one of those before, right. okay? Um, what I think is going on, um, is something called pericarditis, okay? Mm. And it's a big word for basically yeah. saying, um, there is a sac around your heart, a lining, and sometimes, for a lot of different reasons, that can become inflamed. Mm. Um, just, just like you know, when you get a cut in your hand, it turns red. Right. Sometimes it can get inflamed like that. Okay. Um, and it can be due to a lot of different things. It can be due to a virus. Um, it can also be due, what it, which, which is what I think happened in your case, um, to the fact that you missed a couple of your dialysis appointments. Mm. I know that sounds very scary, um, but it can actually be managed with um, some ibuprofen oh, and, um, okay. you know, getting some dialysis right away. Do you have any other questions for me no, right just, now? No, just, just get to the bottom of it. Okay. 